That changed this morning. Washington announced that the game was off because of ongoing contact tracing involving members of the Nationals organization. ESPN's Jeff Passan says that there may be at least one more positive test on the Nationals roster. I bumped into Mets fans Peter Sapson and his son who were heartbroken after making the trip to D.C. We're all anxious. We're from New York and here with my son and we were going to grab the game tonight, but heard it got called off, so just another bummer for the year. We're very disappointed, you know, we were looking forward to it and it's, it ended up being a beautiful day and we're going to enjoy uh, opening day in a different stadium. Yeah, it's pretty disappointing, but it's cool to be here and see the stadium. I've been a fan for a long time, I guess. Met centerpiece Francisco Lindor, fresh off of a new deal for 10 years worth $341 million, is disappointed to say the least. I was bummed. I was bummed out because I wanted this one. I wanted to play. I know we're going to have an open day. I know we will. Uh, it's just a matter of when. The Nationals said the game will not be made up tomorrow and there are no further plans. Saturday's game is still up in the air. At Nationals Park, I'm Natalie Calabat, PIX11 News, Washington, D.C.